Today we are at Easton's Creek completing a cold water creek restoration project. We are planting 73 black willow and silver maple trees to enhance this cold water creek habitat by providing shade for the brook trout. This project is generously funded by the Cabela's Canada Outdoor Fund and our partners include the Lanark County Stewardship Council, the Lanark and District Fish and Game Conservation Club and the Mississippi Valley Conservation Authority. Mississippi Valley has partnered with Watersheds Canada for a number of years to do the monitoring as part of their stewardship projects. So that means the crew from the monitoring team at Mississippi, we come out here with a temperature logger, we launch it for the full season, and that monitors the temperature profile, especially during these hottest parts of the summer in August and July. And that tells us how stressed the fish might be getting in a season. The second thing that the crew comes out and does is we come out here with our electro fishing gear, which is a standardized way of collecting fish samples from a stream such as this. And then we wade the stream with that gear and we collect the fish. We measure and ID everything we collect. We submit those sightings to the MNR. And in there, that tells us the record of who's actually living here. Are there actually brook trout here? How are they doing? Do we have multiple sizes? mixture of maples and black willow and both of them are suited to the wet habitat here next to Easton's Creek and what we've done already is we've dug a nice hole we planted the root ball we packed it in real tight then we put down this ring it's made of coconut fiber and we chose that as a method to help keep some of the grass down as it's biodegradable it's a natural product and it'll just disappear into nature over time but because this area is full of this reed canary grass which is quite invasive and could choke out our sapling trees we're also going to put down this great big sheet of paper bags and we're going to pin it down to hopefully smother some of the grass to give the tree its best fighting chance at taking off <laughs> 